Hi everybody, it's Connie from the Danville Public Library, back with you again today with a new craft. Uh, it's fall and it's apple time. And we know that apples come in many colors. And we're going to make an apple craft today. And you're going to need markers, you're going to need a spray bottle of water, and you're going to need a coffee filter. And everything that you need is in this bag right here. And when you take it out, this is what you're going to find. You will find an Apple crossword and a really nice Apple worksheet. And this one, it says more or one less. So this is talking about greater than and less than. So this is your little worksheet for today, your little activity. When you're finished, when you're finished, your Apple will look like this. So what we have to do first is we have an apple, and it looks like this, and you're just going to take your scissors, and I'm just going to cut a hole out of mine. I'm just going to fold it in half. I'm cutting out a hole. And so this is what you have left. And then take your scissors and cut around the inside black line and cut all the way around it so that when you're finished, you will have an outline of an apple, okay? And you just keep cutting until you get all the way around it. Excuse me, guys. And this is your beginning of your apple. When you're finished, you'll have an outline of an apple that looks like this. So then take your coffee filter and use some markers and I'm using at least three colors. I have some yellow already on there. I have some red and I think I'm going to choose green. Now, oh, I'm just going to put color everywhere, anywhere I want and I'm just going to make it look really cool. Oh, there's some green there, a little bit of green there, a little bit of green there and I've used my three colors. Now, this is the messy part. Make sure that you have a paper under your coffee filter because it will go through, all right? Now, I'm going to put paper towels down here. I'm going to put that there. I'm going to move all of my things over, and I'm going to move this apple because I don't want it to get wet. Now, I'll put it right there. This is the fun part. Oh, I better have a few more paper towels. For sure, it's going to be messy. I take my water bottle and I just spray very lightly. Oh, look at this. And as you spray your coffee filter, you watch all of your colors. And look, they are just going everywhere. And I could even take my finger, I like to do it this way, and I just go like this. And then I'm going to keep, I'm going to put some more water on it and let it just all meld into each other. And you have your colors. And then what you do is you just let it be for a while. Let it soak in. And then I let this dry. So this is going to dry. When it's all finished, you take your outline and you put your coffee filter on the back. If you have any sticking out around the side, you just cut it off and you just tape it or glue it to the back like that. And when you're finished, you have an apple that you can hang in your window. And look, take a look, guys. It's, it's, still, it's still blending in together. And it'll take, oh, and look, I made a great design on my paper towel. But you can put it up and let it dry really, really good. And then put it on the back of your apple and have a nice fall apple craft. Have fun with it. Don't forget to wash your fingers afterwards. Have a good time, guys. Enjoy your craft. See ya.